A very good afternoon to all our viewers. You're watching the breaking news show on CNN News 18. I am Anjali Pandey here to take you through all the latest news and developments from across the nation and around the world. And we're starting off this bulletin with some breaking news that's coming in. And ahead of the Telangana elections, the BJP has revoked MLA Raja Singh's suspension. Now, the Central Disciplinary Committee letter reads, and I quote, Upon suspension, the party had issued a show cause notice to you. Your reply and explanation offered therein has been considered by the committee. Your suspension has been revoked forthwith. Now remember, Raja Singh was suspended by the party last year for making comments that had, that had hurt religious sentiments and uh, now in the latest development, uh, right before the Telangana Assembly polls, the party has decided to revoke MLA Raja Singh's suspension. The letter, uh, the Central Disciplinary Committee letter says that uh, upon suspension, the party had issued a show cause notice uh, to Raja Singh, but uh, his reply and explanation offered uh, uh, were taken into consideration and now the party has revoked the suspension. CNN News 18 Swastika Das is joining us on the story. Swastika, this uh, move by the BJP coming right before the elections, what is going to be its impact? Well, the way to read into this is that this highly makes the desk clear for Raja Singh to now contest from Gosha Mahal once again, which the party in all likelihood is going to allow him to because he's a very strong candidate and he's the only MLA of the BJP, in fact, who had won in the 2018 Assembly election. So as far as the electoral prospects are concerned, decks are perhaps clear for Mr. Raja Singh to contest once again for Gosha Mahal. But having said that, this is also not going to augur well as far as BJP's image is concerned because remember, Raja Singh was suspended last year for making derogatory remarks against Prophet Muhammad, which triggered widespread protests and violence across Hyderabad. The situation was such that uh, almost for a week or so, uh, Section 144 was imposed in several parts of the city, considering how sensitive and volatile the situation had played out. And then he was subsequently arrested, re-arrested, and then let out on bail. As far as his track record is concerned, that is also not quite impressive. Mr. Raja Singh, uh, remember, is or rather has been booked in over 101 criminal cases, majority of them attributed to hate speech cases and this is according to a statement that was released by the Hyderabad police last year. So maybe uh, the BJP remember at this juncture is expected to release its first list of candidates for Telangana elections very soon and a na name that is definitely likely to feature is Mr. Raja Singh. He will be contesting from Gosha Mahal in all likelihood. But Swastika, don't you think this move will be impacting the minority votes in the state? Mr. Raja Singh is concerned. He has held one of the main constituencies in Hyderabad called Gosha Mahal. And like I told you, in 2018, he was the only MLA who had won from the BJP. When it comes to the uh, voters from the majority community, they've always had uh, a strong support uh, that uh, Mr. Raja Singh has got from them. As far as the minority voters, and particularly we're talking about Hyderabad is concerned, they've always voted for the MIM, for the Asaduddin Ovesi family and his brother Akbaruddin, who is an MLA from Chandrayaan Gutta. So in terms of the voter dynamics, uh, BJP is in fact heavily focusing on Hyderabad particularly, and the reason being that in 2020, them winning a majority of seats from the Greater Hyderabad Municipal Corporation has given them the confidence that one area where they can put up a really strong show is Hyderabad. And when you talk about the picture of Hyderabad, that would be incomplete without Gosha Mahal and its MLA Raja Singh. So that is why, uh, as the BJP is expected to release its first list of candidates perhaps any time soon, uh, Raja Singh's name is definitely going to feature on that list. And that's the reason why his suspension being revoked especially at a crucial moment like this is leading to that doorway all right swastika thank you so much for giving us all those details on the story and 